Sometimes, for example, suppose that you got the topography in Revit and then you want to simulate it based on gradient and then uh, set a specific colors for a specific gradients. I mean for low and high gradients. Anyway, I select this and edit surface. Here because I want to change the elevation because the surface is too flat. For example here, 12 meters. Check this out. And then for the another one, minus 20. In this way and then here and here and for here I set 22 for example in this way and this 15 and here place point and relative to surface 20 toward this point and toward this point Control Z actually destroyed the construction I mean it cover it 5 and I place some points here ok well done and then I finish it cancel here I remove section box these parts which are cut are because of the section box Watch this, we removed it. Anyway, and continue, I select it and isolate element. And right now I'm gonna s simulate the gradients by Dynamo. So to do this, I search for select model element. In this way, and after that I select the topography. In this way, actually here you need to get installed the package of here mesh tool kit. So install this because right now we're gonna work it, work on with, and the springs as well. So I open it, mesh, and then here in the items, let me see. Actually, I'm looking for topography mesh. Let's find it. Actually, here we got too many items. Let me see. Let me check the below of the list. Let me search in the library box, topography, actually here mesh topography. I'm sorry because it is in Revit to get the underlying triangle mesh from the topography. But we will use mesh toolkit later but here it's located in Revit packages. So I added and then I specify topography and right now we got the underlying triangle mesh for the topography. Check this out. Actually here we got a warning, one or more geometries have failed to convert due to this error. And actually the reason is because of the points which I, which I placed in the topography as you remember. Anyway it is not important, here we got by points, but since we don't have any point, I remove it. Anyway after that from springs, and then in geometries, and then in mesh and after that here I create toolkit mesh and then I give the mesh I hide the preview of mesh to keep the toolkit mesh here actually and right now from mesh toolkit mesh and then triangles to convert the mesh faces into surface patches actually triangle normals I'm sorry I hide this and then I give the toolkit mesh. Check this out in this way. We got the vectors in the list. Show preview. So here we got the normals for each triangle face. And right now I want to search in the vectors, geometry, vector, and then I add angle with vector to get the angle between two vectors. And then I specify the vectors in this way and I specify Z with other vector 
in this way right now check out the list we got the angles between two vectors or the height of them then I search for remap remap range and then I specify the numbers or the values and then for minimum and maximum 0 and 1 in this way and then I add a color range in this way I give the list to the value and then I add a code block for indices and I define 0 to 1 and for colors I add color palette and then I make some copies for color palettes in this way and then I specify a color for each of them so in this way green yellow and for the another one for example suppose that purple and then I at least create to add the items here we got four items or how many you want I specify the colors and then I save and then I specify colors very well well done anyway right now I'm gonna search for mesh display here to display mesh by single color triangle colors or vertex colors I give the mesh color ring and then for mesh I, spe I specify mesh toolkit check this out I hide this to observe it better so right now we simulate the topography based on gradients anyway you can simulate the topography or site or stuff like that based on colors and then consider the color gradients let me change the place of these items in this way check this out here as you can see the flat surface is green and check out the red ones I change this to manual and then I wanted the places of I'm gonna change the places of these items in this way for example yellow for the first one and red and green in this way and run to show the flat parts with yellow run let me remove purple check this out